privilege of meeting Bob and sustaining a relationship with Bob over the years. Um, so one, so Bob actually has his own sort of, you know, uh, investment sort of shop that he um, sort of, you know, produced himself, and he has a great team that's uh, that that works for him there. So, but in situations like that, I think it it all falls back to where you want to go with this. Like, what is the goal? Like, what is to to come of this? Is this a situation where you know you want to you know join forces with the individual and you know bring on to what I've developed and created over these years? You know, or are there different wills or different you know trust attached there? You know, um, different sort of you know power of attorney things like that. So, but it all it all alludes back to you know where you're trying to go because without that, you know, we're kind of in a tough spot in terms of providing any sort of solution. Do but I was just want to ask you: Do you find that prenuptials are more commonplace than they used to be because of the way things are now? Yes, it, absolutely. Uh, and you see, I mean, situations like that where you have you know two different sort of you know um, you know financial backgrounds. I often laugh because a lot of my te- a lot of my former teammates and friends that I know professionally, they bring that conversation up like that. So mm-hmm. it's just like, yeah, I love you to death and I want to share the world with you, but uh, I need you to sign this sheet of paper mm-hmm. saying that if anything happens, you walk away with what you came in with, right? But it's a very transparent thing uh, when you start to talk about different sort of tiers of wealth. It's a conversation that needs to be had. And you know, a lot of times people are on different pages and that creates friction. But again, I mean, this all boils back to just being very straightforward and uh, say, hey, this is what we want to do and this is where we want to go. Mm-hmm. Um, I will let that be the last question. Um, let's give our panelists a round of applause. <laughs> um,